What's up, everyone? I'm Sam from Single. We are a Shopify app for artists. We help you sell your music alongside your merch, as well as do live streams, fan clubs, and a whole bunch of other stuff direct to fan in your store. If you're here, you probably already have a Shopify store or are thinking about starting one. If the latter is you, don't worry. We have videos to catch you up and help you get started. But in this video, I'm going to give you the basics on how to get started in Single. So I'll show you how to install Single, pick the right plan, add your team, and really, that's it. You'll be ready to go. So let's get into it. So first things first, you'll need to install Single into your Shopify store. Like I said, if you don't have a Shopify store, we'll provide those links to catch you up. But assuming you have one, just go ahead and go to single.xyz. That's our website. Click start for free. It'll redirect you to our Shopify app store listing. Now, if you're in your Shopify admin, you could also get to this page by going to the app section. In the Shopify app store, search for our app, type Single, click add app, and follow the prompts to install. It's literally that simple to get Single integrated and connected to your store. Now that you have Single installed into your store, your next step is to actually pick a plan. You'll notice that Single has a number of plans, but if you're new here and just getting started, which you probably are if you're watching this video, just opt for our starter plan. It allows you to start selling your music, creating a fan club, even hosting a live stream, all without any upfront costs. Once you open up the app for the first time, you'll notice a banner that prompts you to pick a plan, but you could also pick a plan in the Single Settings section. So on the left side, you'll see a section for settings, click usage and billing, and then just go ahead and click your plan. The whole goal of our starter plan is really to help you get started earning as soon as possible in your artist store. Now, of course, depending on your needs, you could always upgrade, downgrade, or just cancel your plan in the same way that I just showed you to set one up. Now, when you do pick a plan for the first time, you'll notice that Single will automatically redirect you to your Shopify store to approve app charges. Single utilizes a usage-based pricing model. So just go ahead and click approve app billing, and this will allow us to deduct our commission on any sale you make at the time of a sale through your Shopify store. If you're an artist, it's not uncommon to have a manager, an agent, or just a larger team helping you with your releases, your fan clubs, your live streams in your store. So you could add them to your single account by going to settings and then users. Simply add their email addresses and then assign prefixed roles like admin or agent, or you could even create your own. This will allow your full team to collaborate with you on anything you're setting up in your online store through single behind the scenes. And that's it. You're all set. From here, you could get started creating your music releases in single, setting up live streams, fan clubs, and a whole bunch of other stuff. Of course, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out and I'll see you next time.